are looking at the Veep stakes for the former Veep. Uh, Joe Biden, of course, now is one of that list down. The name Susan Rice keeps coming up in the latest tranche of talk. Jackie Heinrich following all of that in New York. Jackie. Hey there, Neil. Well, many experts believe uh, former Vice President Joe Biden will select a black woman as his running mate. And Susan Rice has been quietly gaining steam. Rice, who served as President Obama's national security advisor, has a very strong relationship with Biden. And despite criticism, she's an untested candidate who's never run for elected office. Biden has said he wants a VP who won't be learning on the job. Rice recently showed off her foreign policy chops, weighing in on the allegation Russia may have offered bounties to kill American troops. Who is doing our arch adversary's bidding, it would seem, and he's surrounded by sycophants and weaklings who aren't doing their jobs, who don't have the confidence in themselves and in the mission that they're there to carry out to bring the president the tough messages he needs to hear. Rice was asked about being a VP contender, but mostly dodged the question, saying Biden will make the decision and she will do her best to get Biden elected, either as a running mate or as a door knocker. Another woman of color, Senator Tammy Duckworth, is also moving to the front of the pack. The Iraq combat veteran and Purple Heart recipient reportedly has impressed the campaign. She also made history as a young mother in Congress. The most surprising news out of the campaign this past weekend is Kanye's Twitter announcement he's running for president in 2020. It's not the first time he's floated the idea but he reportedly has not filed with the FEC or created a campaign committee. And there's also criticism he may just be running to try to pull black voters away from Joe Biden and help President Trump get reelected. Neil. All right. Um, thank you very much on all that, Jackie.